going to drive, go baseline. Nice cutter off down there. She'll swing it up top to Raven. Going to drive, back it in with a left hand move to the basket. Laid it up and in. Nice move with a 6-1 junior. Foul was on Miranda Crockett and not McGowan. Check it. Gamecocks beat the press. Patterson down to the basket. Kiki Patterson attack went right to the rack. They didn't stop her and she laid it up and in. Morrison for the baseline. Got it to Raven. Reverses it out left side to Taylor Hawks. Open the three ball up and in. Taylor Hawks. They reversed it. She was open and she made them pay. It's no good. Rebound Raven Pearson already. Her fifth of the afternoon. Hawks got only out, got it ahead to Magruder, who caught it, laid it in. Tasha runs the floor pretty well and got rewarded with it that time. First time she's a true freshman is Jayla Walker. Chloe Long going to go right down the baseline. Or excuse me, right down the foul lane. Here comes Strain to the offensive end of the corner to Kiana Johnson. Open in the three, got it on the right side. Kiana Johnson drills the three. Ah, knocked away. Coco forced the turnover. Hawks out of there with it. Well, with it, dishes Coco. Yes, San Juan coming. Coco caught it, came to a jump stop, gave a little hesitation move, and laid it up and got foul. Made the shot, count the bucket, and the foul call will be on Blaine. Nice pass, Hawks. Coco, a jump stop there, and then went up. Blaine got her on the hand. Here, are Hawks with it. She'll feed it inside. Coco got inside position on Todd and banked it up and in. Coco. Hawks up top. Picks up the dribble inside to Magruder. Caught it, laid it in. And she's hurt. She is hurt. I don't know if it's a knee or an ankle. She went down gingerly. And now she comes up limping. Looks like she's okay. Attack from Lopez, but no whistle. She looks, feeds in the lane to Raven. Going to step around McGowan. Nice move. Banked it in with the left hand. She has done that well lately. Jackson will stay with the ball down one. Taylor Hawks finds the lane. Drives to the basket. Scooped it up. No good. Raven the rebound. Pearson. The follow-up and the putback. Give Jacksonville State offensive points on that one. Or up to the up top with the basketball. They go to Gretchen. Three ball got it. Knocked it down. Oh, I wish she could get hot here. Gretchen Morrison hits her first three of the day. Fly to her. She's going to drive it. Stop. Feed Strain. Shot, claw, uh, shot fake. She'll put up a shot. It's a three. And Strain will tie it up at 45. 47. Down low. Coco starts right. Back to the left. Right again. Shot an ear ball. But Chloe Long will clean it up. Score the basket and a foul call here coming for Jacksonville State. I thought he said two shots. It'll be one shot for Cloy. The foul is on Aaron. Across the timeline. Pitches it toward the corner to Johnson. Nice fake. Will drive. Reverse layup. Got it. Went in under the basket and put it back up and in. Nice play by the freshman. Strain across with four, with three, all the way to the basket. Laid it up and in. She went coast to coast. Nobody stopped her, went to the basket and banked it up and in. In the third quarter of play, Penn State 49. This is the Gamecock Sports Network. 54-53. Chloe Law caught it in traffic to the basket drives. Laid it up and in with some contact. Taylor looks, Raven wants it, got it down low, going to face the basket. Lobs to Coco, caught it underneath, banked it up and in, good look. She rotated from the high post as Raven slid toward the outer on the elbow out there. She has not had a good day shooting threes. Left side to Kiana, finds a lane, drives, stops, jumper long, back iron, no good. Rebound, Coco, Felon follows it back up and in. Jack Hawks drives, stops outside, she'll feed Gretchen the three, bingo! Gretchen Morrison knocks down the triple. And a block shot, she checks in. Inbounds pass, Kiana Johnson under the basket, call a turn, hits a shot. A double digit day, the first of her career. It's a career high for Kiana Johnson. She, and it's Raven Pearson's 10th board of the day. She's got a double double. Hawks to Johnson, lays it up and in as they beat him on the break. 140, 100 seconds left. Jacksonville State by seven, 68-61. Have a day, Kiana Johnson. Timeout, Greg Tide, Moorhead State. Three to go, 68-61, they lead it. Timeout, this is a Gamecock Sports Network. They'll lob it in to Raven Pearson. And they're not going to foul. They'll just let them inbound it. They got it in, and that'll do it. Jacksonville State with a huge win here, knocking off Moorhead State, 70-64 the final. Ladies are 2-0 in the league, and now 8-5 overall. Moorhead State will fall to 10-5 on the year.